Hello everyone, welcome to Aspet's video on how to assemble a biped robot. Today we're looking at how to assemble a biped robot, so let's get start. Take the parts out of the package and check the parts against the parts list. If any parts are missing, please contact support at acebot.com. Remove the protective paper attached to the acrylic. Please combine videos and assembly documentation to build the product accurately. From the perspective shown in the below, if the hole in the heel is tilted towards the right side, it is the left sole. If the hole in the heel is tilted towards the left side, it is the right sole. Not a shorter piece of acrylic is used here. Installing right sole in the same way. Note, the installation direction of the left and right servo shafts and the orientation of the heel holes should be consistent. Note, the installation direction of the left and right servo shafts and the orientation of the heel holes should be consistent. Note, the raised part of the rudder plate should face the round hole. Note, both screws should be locked in the outer round holes.
Note, the direction of the rudder plate on the straight rudder plate fixing bracket should be facing downward. Note, the direction of the rudder plate should face outward. Install the second in the same way. Note, both server shafts should be installed toward the wide side of the acrylic. The operation is as follows. Two 18,650 batteries are required to supply power to the controller board. Note, turn the servo shaft down and forward to distinguish left and right. Note, the left side servo connect to GPIO5. Note, the right side servo connect to GPIO18. Servo initialization complete. Note, when assembling this structure, the side with the steering wheel needs to be installed facing forward. Note, the left cap servo connect to GPIO16. Note, the right cap servo connect to GPIO17. Servo initialization complete. Note, the servo shaft should be installed facing inwards.
Now, the M3 nickel plated lug nut can be fixed with a 7 shaped wrench, but it does not need to be tightened too much, just enough to ensure that the cap structure can rotate freely. Install the second in the same way. Note, when installing the battery box, the wired end should be in the same direction as the controller board power point. Now, ensure that all cables are correctly connected before powering on the device to avoid burning the modules and controller board. The white wire trick, GPL13, 
the blue wire echo gpio 14 the red wire vcc 5v the black wire gnd gnd The corresponding pins of the servos of the bipedal robot, left side servo, GPIO5, left cat servo, GPIO16, right side servo, GPIO18, right cat servo, GPIO17.